Hey Shook, welcome back to the Healing Circle. So we're here to do the Daily Collective for Thursday, January 18th. Okay, this is for Thursday, January 18th. Now, if the reading does not resonate, please do not try to make it. Okay, very important. All right? The energy for the week is about regeneration. Okay, that's about rebirth, second chances, new opportunities. Okay, so let's see. What is it that we have for the collective for Thursday, January 18th? Thursday, January 18. No place like home. Okay. With happy, happy on the bottom. Okay. So the energy for today is no place like home. Number 50. He's a... Oh, Bottom of the deck is happy, happy, number 26. All right. So let's read the overall energy of happy, happy. Okay. So happy, happy is about joy and contentment. A sense of fulfillment, a feeling that all is well. Okay. Oh. <laughs> the message says this Your desires are effortlessly fulfilled now. Find joy in the present moment, whatever is happening, and be satisfied with things as they are. You're free from the shackles of longing and able to experience the liberation that comes from actually being happy. Moment to moment, for you have chosen happiness over yearning for it. Now is the time for feeling joy for the sake of joy and experiencing contentment. None of this is because of something outside of yourself. Your happiness is a result of your being at one with spirit's plan for your life. All is well. The tide is in for now. Enjoy playfully splashing in it. Okay. Isn't that fun? Like when you go to the beach and the tide isn't heavy or um, strong and you can just kind of just enjoy yourself playing in the water. Okay. Yeah. You, you don't even have to worry about being like pulled out to sea. Okay. <laughs> like you just kind of just play around in the water. Right. Let's see. Why is happy happy here for the collective? Why well, is happy, happy here for the collective? Because with no place like home, it's like, that's a feeling of peace. Yeah. Eight of Pentacles and the Six of Wands. Okay, so something that you've been working on, maybe this could even be something at work. Um, yeah, you're getting some type of success or recognition from it with the Six of Wands. Okay, this can be a message um, that you receive. All right with the high priestess energy okay this can be effort that is um effort or even something that you are being offered that is a wish fulfillment that does bring about success for you okay um and with the high priestess energy okay this can be something that someone is keeping like if someone is offering you something okay or an opportunity to progress something forward or to recognize you in some way, they're not really telling others about it, okay? And I feel like it's because they don't want to hurt someone else or um, break someone's heart. It's like someone's telling you, like, you know, you've been putting in a lot of effort and, you know, we're going to give you the position, but I'm just not announcing it yet, you know? Okay, but the Three of Pentacles, right? And the Three of Wands. This is building towards the future, okay? Building towards your future, right? Yeah, removing stagnation, Okay? You don't even have, like, what's happening right now for you with this happy, happy card here? All right, yeah. What's happening right now for you with the happy, happy card here is you allowing, yeah, that's the message, is you allowing, um, excuse me, is you allowing the, allowing spirit to execute the plan that spirit has for you, okay? With the Page of Cups energy and the Empress, Okay, this is um, if something has been like on hold, okay, or um, 
yeah, if something has been like on hold or held up in some way, this is like, you know, recognizing that, mending it, okay, and moving forward, okay? This is building towards the future, putting in effort, putting in work, okay? Yeah, Ace of Wands, okay? Yeah, removing stagnation. It's like a whole, it's a brand new beginning, okay? And it's going to make you very happy, all right? But you have no place like home here, right? Whatever's happening, um, even if it's working on something in secret, okay? Whatever's happening, it's about building for the future, okay? Moving forward. Um, mending and starting anew, okay? No place like home is number 50. And it says this. Authenticity, coming home to yourself, feeling at home, arriving at a place where you just fit, being comfortable in your own skin. Home feels safe and secure. It's a comfortable place to rest and create, a place that is known and you can call yours. This card signals that your ability to trust yourself and feel at home in your own skin is beginning to solidify as you claim your dignity and integrity. Aspects of yourself no one can take away from you. You know who you are. You hold your head high, yet with neither pride nor humility. Instead, you stand as the observer, which started off at the beginning of the week, seeing through the eyes of your soul. This puts you in a position of power and strength. Authenticity is your home. You are safe here in the house of your spirit and spirit. Okay? authenticity you going down a direction that you feel is truly meant for you okay why is no place like home here okay and others may not agree with it okay yeah two of one others may not agree with it okay but you kind of you know what's best for you okay the two of wands is choosing a path okay it says planning and decisions okay someone is definitely choosing the path with the knight of wands energy and the ten of wands Okay, someone could have um, could have taken actions that they feel really bad about, okay? Um, this can be someone whose actions have made things very difficult, okay? Um, why is no place like home here for the collective? The Four of Cups, the Ten of Wands. So someone is definitely choosing um, to go in a new direction um, because they're just not happy, Four of Cups. The Four of Cups is the energy of boredom blank being like unfulfilled, okay? The Ten of Wands energy and the Ten of Cups, this is like being burdened by an illusion, okay? The Ten of Cups is like the dream of family or um, happily ever after, you know, that you might be given to. Okay, with the six of pentacles, you someone could have been given to an illusion. It's like, oh, I'm giving, you know, I'm working day in and day in, day out for a, a, you know, a company that I hope promotes me, but they're not. Okay, and you have a whole nother, you know, opportunity over here that you like won't even entertain because you're like holding on strong to a company that's not really giving back to you. Okay, this is someone choosing to go into a new direction because they're not happy, okay? They're not being fulfilled, okay? No place like home, okay? And someone is following their spirit, okay? They're allowing themselves to be directed by spirit and um, being authentic and true to themselves. Why is no place like home here for the collective? Okay. Two of Swords, okay? Two of Swords is like, is it is a stalemate. It's a stalemate and indecision, okay? Yeah, this can be someone that feels like no movement is happening, no change is happening. And with the Nine of Wands and the Eight of Swords, is someone that's like tired of feeling stuck and restricted, 
It's like, I'm choosing to go in a new direction because I'm not happy in my current situation, Four of Cups, okay? Um, two of Swords is like no movement happening, no decisions being made, still made, okay? Knight of Swords is removing the stagnation, Knight of Pentacles, okay? And that energy has been coming out, okay? So an offer is being made with the Page of Pentacles. Judgment energy is a second chance, okay? It is a second chance. Justice and a Ten of Wands. Ten of Cups and a Ten of Pentacles. Okay? So this new direction, this decision, this um, clarity, this uh, idea to collaborate and to put in effort on a new beginning, it is justice, okay? For all of what someone has been experiencing, Ten of Wands, okay? That's obstacles, difficulty, um, burdens, hurdles, like one thing after another, okay? Yeah, and it's bringing about the Ten of Cups and the Ten of Pentacles. And I was listening to, there's that tarot, and she she also mentioned how it's one thing that had a Ten of Cups, that's, that's the illusion. But when you do the Ten of Cups and the Ten of Pentacles, that's solid, okay? Yeah. So that's what I have for you, Shug. I hope this helped. I look forward to seeing you guys soon. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe. Wish you guys already. <laughs> Bye.